Alright guys, so unfortunately my plan here was here to do, you know, a few this, that, blah, 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 you know. Trips with my wife. That was the actual plan for me to travel here and do a few plans I had with her. Unfortunately, nothing happened due to the fact that my country, Bangladesh, is actually on a strict national lockdown so today I'm gonna go out <clears throat> with my wife my um, cousin-in-law my brother-in-law and my other cousin-in-law we're gonna go travel during the lockdown and see how it is how everything is we're gonna rent a rickshaw it's a little two-wheeler two wheelers in the back and a single wheel in the front we're gonna travel go on a little tour and see how everything is all right hopefully you guys like it hopefully you guys comment comment it comment it share it subscribe to it remember do subscribe to my channel because i have really really good good and juicy stuff coming along and after that when i come back i got a juicy plan for you all just stay tuned let's get it peace Alright guys, so I just got out during lockdown with my wife, my cousin-in-law, my brother-in-law somewhere in the back right there. We're traveling on a so-called nationwide lockdown mic. But anyways, you guys want to see my country? Here you go, see it. Enjoy the view. We're on a really we're on a little ride called the rickshaw. People like to call the two wheeler. As you can hear, my wife is telling the guy to ride slowly. Guys riding a little too fast, but you know, I don't mind. But then I got two little babies in the back, so I don't want to lose them. I believe this is a school. Alright guys, so we just got home from our little tour. Um, fortunately, I wouldn't say unfortunately. Fortunately, it was a great thing because I got out of the house. It was fresh air. Got to see a lot of people. Blah, blah, blah. It, it's not really safe to be around with the camera in Bangladesh. People actually think that you're some type of big, I don't know, producer or something. People kept staring at me. Some people started yelling at me. Well, technically not yelling, cursing at me. I don't know how to explain that, but yeah, it is what it is. But I already did the uh, I already did the prank. I already told them how. Well, I, I didn't. I already told them the prank. They just don't know yet. I just didn't get everyone's reaction yet. But I already told them what's going on. My flight's on August twenty third. That's the original date. I told them that I changed it to August fifteenth, which I didn't. But I told them that while everyone was sitting in the living room. My mother-in-law walked away and my wife walked away. They both went to their room. They both started crying. So, stay tuned and watch the rest of the video. Peace. 
Hi everyone, hello, hola, como esta, salamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hope everyone's doing well because I'm doing very well. Alright, so today is August 2nd. Um, obviously, my flight date is on August 23rd, but I have to actually change the date today to August 15th. So my wife is a little upset with me right now, as you can see. But, um, you know, she's not talking to me. She's really upset with me, but you know, what's the uh, like you know, it's kind of boring. This lockdown is horrible. I'm not used to this lockdown where I'm not allowed to do anything at all, get out, tour, none of that stuff, but yeah. And actually, this this is kind of short too, as well. Uh, it's actually a prank, I didn't change my date. <laughs> My date is still on August 23rd. <laughs> My wife started crying. <laughs> I got her good. <laughs> I got her good. <laughs> let, me, let me put this scarf on her head so you guys don't see my beautiful wife's here. But yeah, I'm still here till August 23rd. Um, I told my mother-in-law while my brother-in-law was sitting beside me as well that I told him I changed my date which I didn't but yeah I'm probably the biggest bullshitter right now my mother-in-law is like saying why did you change it why did you have to change it why did you change your this, this and that and I'm like I'm tired I don't want to be here anymore I'm bored but in reality this was just a little prank I was gonna I was gonna <laughs> I was gonna set up the camera to do this but it's gonna be really obvious <laughs> but yeah I'm not leaving on August 15th I'm leaving on August 23rd <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't record the whole incident, guys, but <laughs> it was fun while it lasted, you know? Let me see if I can open this door real quick. Just move into the patio. Yeah, I got my brother-in-law. He got pranked, my cousin-in-law got pranked, both of them got pranked. Don't worry, I'm not leaving on August 20, uh, August 15th. <laughs> I don't know if I should go tell my grandmother. <laughs> I'm still leaving on August 23rd, so don't worry guys. Thank you. They're playing the little I don't know, test that FIFA soccer game that I be playing sometimes, but I don't know the name. But yeah, look at this beautiful little building here. My wife is still upset. I'm gonna go set up the camera to get my mother in law. She's talking right now, so I'm just waiting. I'm not going <laughs> to. Ma! I'm not going to get a lamb. I'm not going to get a lamb. Ma! Good morning! She's ignoring me. She's ignoring me. Good morning. Good morning. 
Guys, she's actually crying. Mommy <laughs> with that prank or <laughs> She was crying. Look, she's crying, guys. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm serious. I'm I'm not sure. <laughs> Guys, thank you for watching. I got them. Now I gotta listen to their lecture. Wish me luck. All right, guys. So, uh, that little prank you guys saw, it was actually very short due to the fact that it was very random as well. I wanted to get everyone because my brother in law, no one ever pranked him ever, no one was able to ever scare him. So, I actually accomplished that today by scaring my cousins in law and my brother in law, my, um, my wife's brother. <clears throat> I also got my mother in law involved. Yeah, I got them real good. Unfortunately, I couldn't set up the cameras due to the fact one thing is I'm I always play around. I'm a goofball. People know I'm I'm always joking around. Every you, you ask anyone, everyone always says, "Oh no, he always jokes around. He always plays around. He doesn't do he doesn't do anything serious." So, for me to accomplish this plan, I couldn't set up the camera. I had to do it MIA like you know, just think on top of your head how I did it. So, how I planned it was, my wife was sleeping. She woke up. She came into the kitchen, dining room area, where her, where my wife and her cousin-in-law were, or her cousin, my cousin-in-law, her cousin, they were playing a game called Ludo. Uh, I don't know if you guys, anyone know what that game is. It's like a dice game, you play, if a number six pops up and the number two, you move six plus two, blah, 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 whatever, etc., etc. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, long story short, so I was in the living room, everyone's in the living room, and I was like, this is the perfect time for me to say, okay, listen guys, I changed my date, and then my brother-in-law's giving me a lecture of, why did you change the date, you should have told us, now people are going to think like, oh, he, he changed his date all of a sudden, maybe there's a problem with his in-laws or something like that, no, there's no problem at all with my in-laws, there's no problem with my wife whatsoever. It was just a random funny thing I had to do at that instant because it was just hilarious. But yes, I got them really well. Uh, my mother-in-law still upset with me. But I got them. Peace. I'll see you guys soon. Until my next video. Peace. <laughs>